Hi guys, I have a huge Trader Joe's haul to get through, so let's get started in no particular order, but I think the first bag is mainly snacks. The first thing that I got are these caramels. It's actually like a fun little game. It's called Taste Test of Caramels. And you're supposed to take one of these and cut it in a few different pieces depending on how many people you're playing with and then you're supposed to guess the flavors so it's kind of like a fun game to play around christmas and they also look really good and i'm sure they're gonna be delicious next we have these decked out tree cookies i tried them last year and i was obsessed with them so i'm super excited to eat them again they are also really pretty and festive the next item are these crackers. I'm not exactly sure how you pronounce them. I used to eat them a lot when I was back in Bulgaria and I was obsessed with them. So I'm really curious if they're going to taste the same way. Next up is another one of my favorites from last year, the white truffle potato chips. It's really delicious. Then I think we have a new item. It's the trio of almonds with caramel coffee almonds, sesame honey, roasted and salted almonds. And they look pretty good. I love almonds, so I'm sure I'm gonna like these. Then I have a big box of Trader Joe's JoJo's. Uh, I think there are four flavors in here. Double chocolate, peppermint, peanut butter, and vanilla ginger. I've never had these cookies or like any version of them, so I'm excited to try them. I also got a bunch of my favorite protein bars by the brand Bear Bells. And I have cookies and cream, caramel cashew, and this new flavor called Holiday Crisp. Then we got this dark chocolate orange and it's basically dark chocolate orange flavored in the shape of an orange and it's kind of like a fun to eat snack. Next up we have this rolled corn tortilla chips with chili and lime flavor. They're pretty good, kind of intense in terms of flavor but they're really fun to eat and they're delicious. Next up I got these gummies, never tried them. They're probably like a Christmas winter item. I'm excited to try them. It has a fluid center that pleasantly melts in your mouth. So, sounds pretty good, sounds pretty fun. Next up, we got two of these pizzas with mushrooms and black truffle. And I'm only showing you the box because we immediately put them in the oven when we got back from the store. But these are my husband's favorite pizzas and they're really good. If you like mushrooms, I'm sure you're gonna like those. Then we got this eggnog oat beverage and I'm not sure if I really like eggnog, but I wanted to try it again this year. I haven't had it in a while, so I don't know, maybe I'll like it. And they also had a regular version, but we decided to get the oat. Next up, something that came out a while ago, but I still haven't tried them. These egg witches, like breadless breakfast sandwich. I'm curious if this is gonna be good. I've had similar things from other brands, but not the Trader Joe's version. And it only has like two sandwiches, so if I don't like it, not a big deal. I also got one thing of cane sugar. We're gonna try and make chocolate chip cookies. And that was the only ingredient that we were missing, so I had to get it. I also got some lentil pasta. I've never had the Trader Joe's version, but I really like Banza, which is something similar. So I wanted to try this one as well. So I got this one, red lentil pasta and then kind of like spaghetti with um, yellow lentils and brown rice and they're both pretty high in protein so i'm really excited to try it. this one has 15 grams per serving this one has 14. and then i got this selection of trader joe's spices which are really good i haven't tried all of them so i'm excited to see obviously like everything but the bagel is everyone's favorite but yeah, I think that's pretty much the only one that I've tried, so I'm excited to test them all out. Next up, I got a favorite from last year, this uh, hand cream trio, and these hand creams are really, really good. They are in the scents coconut, avocado, and marula. Next up, I also saw that they have some artisanal soaps, uh, handcrafted soaps. There are charcoal and tea tree, coffee bean, and lavender and eucalyptus scented, and again, another great gift. And they're pretty huge, actually. Mmm. Oh, they smell really nice. Well, I'm impressed. I didn't really smell them at the store. And then they released 
another mini candle trio. This one is winter Christmas inspired and the scents are cranberry pine, fresh currant and nutmeg. Okay, moving on to the next bag. I have some uh, pasture-raised eggs. I like to buy them at Trader Joe's because they're very affordable for pasture-raised. I also got this flank steak. I'm gonna make some tacos. I like to slow cook it or like make it in my instant pot and then like kind of shred it. It's really good. Then we have some baby arugula. This is something new, I think. It's this broccoli and cauliflower saute kit and they've also included croutons and walnuts with a basil vinaigrette. So I'm excited to try it tonight, maybe. Next up, I got some ham and cheese for breakfast sandwiches. This brand, Applegate Naturals and some provolone cheese from the Trader Joe's brand. I also got this oven roasted turkey breast for sandwiches again. Some cotija cheese. I think I'm gonna try and make like a Mexican uh, rice bowl or something. Another thing that I got is this really interesting cheese. I'm not even gonna try to pronounce it because it looks like it's in French, but they kind of look like mushrooms. I don't know, excited to try this. Some of my favorite everything but the bagel salmon and then something i think is new it's this herbaceous cheesy bites made with mozzarella parmesan cream cheese and a blend of garlic and herb and it sounds delicious next up some almond milk vanilla flavored some half and half i like half and half in my coffee i got this organic salsa which i've never tried but I'm excited to test it out. Some string cheese for snacking. Some plain Greek yogurt because I really like the Trader Joe's Greek yogurt. It tastes amazing, I think. Then I got these chocolate cupcakes and these are so good. They taste like they came from like a bakery. Really amazing. I don't know how they do it, but they, they are really, really good. Got some little tomatoes for salads and stuff. Bananas, two avocados some English muffins for breakfast sandwiches. This is my favorite Trader Joe's granola, the chocolate and almond granola. I got a big thing of blueberries. And then my favorite Trader Joe's cheese, it's the New Zealand sharp cheddar cheese, and I think it's grass-fed as well. And then I have a few more freezer items that I'm gonna show you guys, starting with the most boring of them, some peas. Next up, I got these chickenless crispy tenders, and they are my favorite they're so good cook them in the air fryer and they are amazing two of them and then i got another favorite of mine these vegan cookies and cream chocolate bonbons they are just the best so so good and then another version of them is the vegan mint chip bonbons they are both really really good i think these are a little bit smaller that's why the box is bigger like you get more of them but i recommend both they're so good and like refreshing and that was everything for my trader joe's haul i hope you guys enjoyed if you did please give it a thumbs up that really helps my channel make sure you subscribe if you like healthy lifestyle and product reviews and trader joe's hauls once in a while thanks for watching and i will see you in my next video bye guys